Hi, so I'm recording while I'm on the cruise. Never done this before. So I wanted to talk to you all about our room. We're on the Carnival Freedom. And right now we're docked in the Bahamas, Nassau. I love Nassau, Bahamas. And um, we're right next to the Carnival Conquest. I'll show you a picture of, of that as well, if I can remember. And it's, there may be the picture that's, that's uh, streaming. Depends on how I feel. But I know I'm going to include some of these pictures of this room. We have a room that's kind of different. Um, and we let them pick our room for us. This is like the second or third time we did this. And I'm kind of glad we did because it's a nice room. It's like on the end. And we have a really extended deck. Um, I like the way the layout is we have very spacious room and it's different so I wanted to just tell you you know go for it let them pick your room um, I think it said like they'll pick the room for you I forgot what it's called but you'll know it so let them pick it we're on the carnival freedom I love the way our deck is we can walk around we have a, a part that's like if we wanted to get a tan or if we wanted to be um, under shade we have a, a place where it's like covered and we can really really just see everything and it's it's really under the bridge but we're actually um not in the front we're in the back and it's pretty neat so i like this little um cabin that we're in it's like a little suite that's what i'm gonna call it and um, we did not pick our assignment we let them assign us a room and we got this really really cheap and i'm glad we came we're on the Carnival Freedom. I like this boat. This is the first time we've been on this boat. It seemed to be an older boat, but uh, very nice. When I first got on, I was very reluctant because it was a lot of people. But things have calmed down. The boat is big enough so that it's not too crowded. Um, when you are on the Lido deck, I will say, go to the part of the dining room, that the back. There's not many people. Everybody's up at the front. So come as far back as you can to the buffet lines and sit down and you won't have a problem but everybody seemed like they congregated in that middle up there in the front of the the Lido deck so come to the back and um our room is not far from the Lido deck that's another plus so I can go up the steps to the ninth floor because we're on the eighth floor and I'll be right at the Lido deck and I like that I don't have to walk through the swimming pool area and I don't have to walk a lot of steps um or I could even catch the elevator but I walk the steps and I'm right at the Lido deck um, uh, the, the workers on here are very nice and I do like this boat. It's, it's a very nice boat and I love our room. A lot of room to walk around on the balcony. The room is spacious. We have a desk and a little, um, little stool in the mirror and then we have a chair and a table and the beds and you can put the beds together. I guess it depends on who you're traveling with or you can leave them separate. And, um, I like this this little boat. I like this room and um, just wanted to share with you all this while I'm on the boat. I don't usually do this, but check out Carnival Freedom and ask them for a, a room. Let them assign your room. Um, don't be mad at me because <laughs> I don't know what they'll assign you. We are platinum and diamond. So they kept apologizing. They gave us drink packages because our um, room wasn't ready. So that's another thing. So uh, maybe... I don't know if they did that because of that, but we got on the boat. We first had problems getting on the boat because they told us our room wasn't ready. And I said, oh, my God, I really was hoping that we could we would make it because we got it dirt cheap. And that was a blessing. But when we got ready to get on the boat, when we parked at the pier, they said, go get your luggage and you all come with us. But they were very, very sensitive, nice. And so they took us somewhere and told us um, to... They would take our luggage, go have lunch on and have drinks on them, and they would call us. And they didn't call us, so we went after we had lunch, and everybody was kind of going to the room. And after we had set sail, because we wanted to make sure we was, you know, we was sailing, I did. I was like, cool. So they can't put us off the boat. My husband said they wasn't putting us off anyway. And then we went up to the guest services, and we was like, okay, we're still waiting on you all to tell us where our room is. And they were so nice. She was like, security's going to come, take your picture, and we'll give you your keys. And she looked at us and was like, you're going to have two windows and a balcony. 
and we do have that and I love it. We wake up to these big windows and then we have a door leading to the balcony. And so when we when I wake up in the middle of the I'll say the morning and I see the clouds, it is absolutely beautiful. So I love this room and I just wanted to share with you all um, about my experience on the Carnival Freedom and letting them assign you a room. So hopefully you'll have a good experience like we did. And they went out of their way to, to, to help us and to accommodate us. And I'm very excited. I like Carnival for right now. All right. So just wanted to share that. All right. Stay with us. There's no telling where we'll go next as we travel the world.